Hello, this is guitar number 559. I've just finished making it. It's a Catalina Roy Owl. It has a 120 year old Sitka spruce top from Alaska. It was originally a salmon crate, and it's got kind of a long, interesting story how this turned into a guitar top. But the grain is so tight in the middle that you can hardly count it. Um, the fact it's so old and it was a salmon crate is why it's, it has different coloring going across the top. It has a darker section going down the middle. It has a Zircote bridge, which I think brings a lot of brightness into the tone uh, of the Bibinga um, guitar. It's my L model, which is a grand concert size. It's a little smaller than the uh, uh, you know uh, a, a southern jumbo that were uh, small jumbo guitars that people make. Uh, it's figured Bibinga. It's from Africa. I think it's just beautiful. It looks like mahogany, but it has a really nice rosewood kind of a balance and warmth to it. Um, this one has a, a sound port with a little step on the sound port. I like to add dimension to my work, and this has a lower ebony, what I call the sound port rosette. Um, that works with the little step on the end of the fingerboard as well. It has a little, a little, uh, you know, a little edge there. The, the rosette is a Central American rosewood. If you look closely, you'll see it has a 14 karat gold line on the inside and a green uh, veneer on the outside. The bridge pins are also ebony and they have little gold rings with the mother pearl. Uh, I haven't put the end pin in yet, but it'll have a matching end pin. Um, ebony uh, fingerboard, uh, Babinga Deco style uh, fingerboard um, position markers, mother pearl uh, markers on the sides of the fingerboard, Godo 510 tuners. They call this Cosmo Black, uh, which I really like because it has a little sheen to it. It's sort of a chrome black look. Uh, it's the Godo 510s, uh, the Delta series, so it's a very smooth line. This has the uh, uh, Art Deco style peg head. And, let's see, what else? <laughs> oh, it has a, a figured babinga on the back of the peg head. Um, it has a mini arm bevel, so it has a nice soft edge here as it goes around. Uh, it's very comfortable. Um, five piece neck with mahogany down the center of the neck and Spanish cedar with ebony lines. Uh, this is it. It's just a pretty little guitar. It's really well balanced, loud. Uh, I'm going to have my friend Jeff Silver play it for you so you can hear it. Um, uh, this is pretty much it. Just finished it up. Um, I hope you get a chance to hear it. Thanks a lot.